Also breaking on first at four, the Gilbert Group home that was at the center of a murder investigation will no longer be allowed to operate. New records obtained by the 12 News I team show that Tilda Manor had their license revoked at that house more than a year after the controversial killing. The I team's Erica Stapleton joins us now with what happened. Erica. Hey guys, the state filed to revoke Tilda Manor's license in July of last year, three months after the murder. And now it's taken 11 months after that for this fight to play out. But we learned this afternoon that Tilda Manor withdrew its appeal to the revocation about two weeks ago, effectively giving up its license. This is the second Tilda Manor location in the Valley the state shut down in the past year. This case all started when group home resident Christopher Lambeth was arrested for killing his housemate Stephen Howells back in April 2021. Tilda Manor was licensed by the state as a behavioral health group home that was supposed to provide 24-7 supervision. When the state went to investigate after the killing, investigators found more than 23 violations, including staff members leaving residents alone or not having proper training. Lambeth was charged with murder and he's entered a not guilty plea. Tilda Manor is also being sued by the victim's family. If you want to know more about this case, you can listen to our entire investigation called Locked Inside wherever you listen to podcasts. And we did send a message to Tilda Manor's attorney. She told me that she couldn't comment just at this time, but we'll wait to hear what she says and bring you the latest when we can. For now, we're live in the Alert Center. Erica Stapleton, 12 News.